In this tutorial, you'll see how to download Bitmoji images, edit these images in Paint, and create and customize a GIF. The tools we'll use today are Microsoft Paint, Remove.bg, and EasyGIF.com. In a folder on your computer, make a spot for a few Bitmoji icons we're going to drag and drop from the Chrome extension. Look for walking images. These are two that I like. And then I also like the double point pose because of the position of the feet. Because what we're about to do is we're going to use the legs for these images and the torso of one of them. So um, edit and paint, drag and make your paint area larger. And then um, when you open the other images in paint, you can control A to select all, control C to copy, control V to paste, and then move it over. Then go back and grab the third image, open it up in paint, control A to select all, control C to copy, then go back to our thought file and control V to paste. Now we've got all three in one spot. Now I'm going to put a rectangle around one and I'll use it to guide our snips. Um, so go to get your snip tool, which you will have in the start menu if you look for snip, and then drag from corner to corner, that's the size of the rectangle, and click save. Rename it and put it in that same folder. And now we're going to erase the legs. And now we're going to go grab the legs from the other Bitmoji. And this one I used the free um, cut because the hand was kind of in the way. And then just drag it over and then you can make that selection transparent. And just kind of get it in position. And then we're going to go back to the snip tool and make a snip that's the, again that size of the rectangle using that rectangle as a guide because we want our images to be the same size or as close as possible. And again erase the legs, go grab the legs from the third one, put them into position, and then we're going to snip it. And save it. This one I got a little bit of the black line in the way, so I needed to crop it a little bit um, before saving. Now I have those three images saved in the folder. I'm going to go to the website remove.bg, which will remove the white background and make it transparent. You just drag it and drop it, look at it, and anything that's a checkerboard will be transparent. If it looks good, click download, and then drag that image back into the folder we're working in. It's just a drag, download, drag, drag, download, drag. All right, then we got all three with transparent backgrounds. Then we go to easygift.com, um, to the gift maker, choose your files, and choose those three that we just made. And you'll see them and put them in order. Now don't click resize, because we were careful to use that rectangle to get them pretty close. I think that that gets rid of transparency. So now we have our gift. The walking looks pretty good. If you want to make that walking smoother, you could try grabbing legs from other Bitmoji positions, but I thought this one looked pretty good for now. So again, optimize and save, and there you go. That's how you make your Bitmoji walk.